Hi, my name's Alan King, and I'm going to review the Canon Deluxe Photo Backpack 200 EG from Canon Cameras. This is a black and green accent bag. It's good looking, it's very rugged, and it's been well thought out and designed by the team from Canon Cameras. When it comes to design, comfort, and longevity, Canon really have put an awful lot of thought at the design stage for this product. The Canon design team really have put a lot of thought into not only protecting your camera equipment, but also protecting you as well whilst you're out and about in the field. Looking underneath, we can see the two loops there which are very heavily stitched into the bag body itself and you would use these to attach your tripod when walking in the field just like so. You can either have it with your bag or without. On both sides of the camera bag there are two heavily reinforced loops again for fastening items to the bag like a monopod or any other larger equipment that you would like to use. When it comes to strapping the backpack to your body Canon have these two level strap fasteners. There is a chest fastener and there also is the waist level fastener. So the bag is really securely attached to your body, making it comfortable when you're wearing it out in the field and it doesn't bang about against your body, rattling or damaging any equipment inside and chafing your body as you walk or you run. At the back here, you can see that it has a mesh material and two channels that allow your skin to breathe. It's heavily padded so that any equipment in the bag itself is not going to bang against your body. And because you have this nice mesh material, your skin breathes and this reduces the amount of sweating. Very well thought out. Alright, so we, we now know that this is a good camera bag, heavily built and at a very good price. Now let's start a look at what we can keep inside of this bag. The outer pocket, as you see here, is not actually padded, so I wouldn't put anything in there that uh, is not rugged and which will break your heart if it does get damaged. I've got a few items in there which, uh, which are rugged and uh, really aren't too expensive. As you can see we've also got an outside pocket which I don't actually personally use and then unzip the outer pocket and inside we have another area for more items. These little pockets here are perfect sizes for holding your compact flash cards and you've got two further pockets there to give some protection. And then we go finally into the body of the bag and there you can see a camera well fastened in with a large 300 millimeter zoom lens it has a nice handy little velcro fastener which holds the camera in place so it doesn't fall about it's a full-size DSLR camera with a battery pack on the bottom and also a quick mount for a Manfrotto tripod and that fits in there perfectly. We have some macro tubes, a 18 to 55 millimeter zoom lens, another lens and that one is a 35 to 80 millimeter zoom and lots of other items in the other pockets as seen here. There really is plenty of storage area for most of the things that you would need for a day or weekend trip out with your camera. Now that we've emptied that area, we can have a look in the inner two compartments, which are separated by mesh pockets for storing other items. Here I have a flash unit and a bubble level. And also uh, in the bottom section, the bottom mesh bag, I keep things like the couple of spare filling flashes, 
a lens brush and of course something you should never be without but plenty of spare batteries I certainly don't think anybody can deny that this little bag can fit an awful lot of camera bits and bobs into it as we can see here a camera three lenses a lens blower various flash units various filters compact flat it, it just contains a lot all in those spaces and as you can see there it's very very well padded it really will take care of any camera equipment you want to put in there and will take most abuse that you will give to it honestly you've done a great job Canon I really want to applaud you for keeping the price down as I say at $40 you really can't complain for what you get it's very very well thought out I would definitely give this piece of equipment a five star rating one little thing to be uh, careful of though it does have a Canon badge on the back and that does advertise what's inside of the bag so if you're taking a photo shoot or you're taking your camera into a, a bit of a dodgy area you may want to uh, remove that little badge so nobody knows what's inside but that's more a comment on society than a shortcoming of the bag itself I really have to take my hat off to you Canon this is a great bag at a great price point thank you go and buy it <laughs>